So, Carney, you're the global chairman at HLB. For how long have you been in this family? Uh, I started my work and career in uh, 17 years ago with HLB. The world has changed so much, you know, the, because and, and our profession as well, because of all the global trends, technology, innovation, social and demographic shifts. But the main thing for me now, the difference between back then and back now, is uh, not so much the change, but the speed of change. So how are you going to future-proof HLB? We are, have all those emerging technologies. What's your idea of, as a CEO? I think really what we are going to do is uh, redefining the way we, we work. Uh, we work with each other, we work with our clients. So just to be more specific, uh, on one side we want to create more value for our clients. We want to provide the better and more exciting learning opportunities for our people. And we want to create even more positive impact uh, on our communities. Uh, how are we going to do that? It's, in my view, it's, a, it's an easy answer. So we're going to invest uh, quite heavily in talent, in technology, and of course, in the strengthening the HLB brand proposition, which is uh, truly linked with those points. And uh, I think this also goes hand in hand with uh, our transformation in terms of what kind of services we actually deliver and uh, uh, help our clients with. So I wanted to ask you on this. What have you been seeing in the relationship between our clients and ourselves? What are they asking us? Well, HLB is already for a long time not only about tax and audit or accounting. Uh, business advisory services are a substantial part of our growth right now. And just, just look at yourself. You have a consulting background. You don't even have tax or accounting as a background. That shows how important HLB finds consulting and advisory services and all this for our clients. I, I agree with you. I think it's a uh, very good combination uh, in general. And uh, you're right in saying that my background is not tax and accounting. My background is mostly business transformation, entrepreneurship, always with an eye in, on technology, uh, but always in commercial environments. So um, I think really together is a very powerful combination to understand really the needs of, uh, of the marketplace, um, of, the, of the clients. Um, but let me just uh, add something to, uh, to what you were saying earlier about advisory services. So it is true that we are going to um, really uh, grow more uh, in terms of advisory services. That's going to be even a bigger part um, of our work in the future. Uh, on one side, I want to also make it clear that tax and accounting will stay very important in our business. Um, what we're going to do is invest heavily, not just to maintain high level of quality, but also to uh, make those services more efficient because ultimately who uh, are going to benefit from, from them are our clients. And what I think is very important uh, and why we're moving more and more into providing more advisory services is that on one side, uh, we, we earn the trust um, from our clients uh, and on the other, that entrepreneurial culture um, really makes it uh, relatively easy for us to deliver more value and personalize uh, really uh, solutions um, for, our, for our clients. And uh, I think that is gonna make a big, uh, a big difference in the future, this personalization element, together, of course, uh, um, with the investment that we are gonna make, that we are making in stronger industry uh, knowledge across different industries. Because you can only be a good advisor if you have deep knowledge of the industry your client is, is working in. Your entrepreneurial spirit is, will be deeply embedded in the HLB culture. I totally agree with you, Corny. Thank you. Yeah.